Hello, and welcome back to The Binding of Isaac. In the last episode, we got scary, spooky. Okay, let's go down into the next level. Up, jumping down into a hole, falling, and die. All right, what do we got here? All right. We got a big old map, and the secret room is down there. I would have never guessed that the secret room would have been there. Good thing it shows us. Oh, very nice. Since we're a ghost, we can fly over the shit. And uh, we can... Oh, yeah, that's another thing. Since uh, we got ghost shots, it's a little bit harder to uh, hit um, explosive barrels. So that's going to be a downfall on our part. Oh, and another thing. Do you see these spikes? They don't hurt us. It's very nice to have spooky, scary... <gasps> the best item in the game. Well, it's more common than you think it is, but it's very pleasant, pleasanting to hear. Listen. Mm, very nice. Okay, we got a battle room. Now, the way that the battle room is, is that there's a little thing in the middle. Um... But the condition of picking it up is that you have to fight people for it. And I think I'm willing to do that. The virus. I get poisonous touch. Let's uh, use the balls of steel. Ah, oh, cool. Now, um, I hit the Q button to use the pill. And um, there we go. I wonder if I still have lust. Yes, I do. This is perfect for me since I have lust and chocolate milk. And this is the battle room, so I can um, take out enemies uh, quicker. And I deal more damage. Oh, come on. I, I thought I was going to take deal more damage. Okay, cool. Yeah, I am. Nice. Okay, we got uh, these things. The pink ones follow you. The white ones fire at you. And this should be the last wave. They only do three waves. There we go. <gasps> cancer. Okay, now I'm going to tell you what cancer does. Um, cancer makes it so that health is uh, drops less often. You know, the little red hearts? It makes it drop less often. But what it does is that it makes you much more powerful. Um, so, yeah, do I want cancer? <laughs> That's a question that nobody ever wants to say. All right. Um, I don't think I want cancer. So we'll drop that. Oh! I can't bomb into that room? I wasted a bomb. Sad face. Alright. Oh, these guys. Now, I call these dudes the uh, Blood Spurtin' Vajayjays, but because of the DLC, it added more enemies. And these guys are maggot firing Vajayjays, in my opinion. Um, but what they are is um, just the body of gluttony, and gluttony opens up that little thing in its chest that shoots out um, a bunch of blood. Oh, crap. Okay. Now, the red ones um, shoot out spiders, so it might be in your best interest to take out them first. And lucky for us, we can shoot through rocks. This would have been much more harder if uh, we didn't have ghost form. So, just letting you know. Alright, there's the boss room. These guys are like uh, the double flies, except they're double spiders. So, when you take them out... Shit. Oh, we have poisonous touch. That's right. Um, is that when you take them out, they split into two spiders. Oh, come on, you fucker. I remember starting every single morning. Um, like, uh, I would wake up, I would play this game, and then I would go on my workout... Yeah, this is a very good game. I highly suggest to buy it. And this game is super, super cheap. It's like, uh, what is it, like five bucks. Oh, God damn it. And, it, like, it is the best value you will ever have. I think I have, like, over a hundred hours on this game. Um, yeah. All right, oh my God, look at that. This right here on the end is the battery. The way that the battery works is that, um, it, um, do you know your spacebar item right over here? Well, um, when you have the battery, it gives you a quicker charge so that uh, your items recharge faster. 
Also, while picking up, it immediately recharges your space item, so it's also beneficiary that way. Okay, we gotta remember that there's a heart there. Okay, we got these Epicac things. Unfortunately, they don't blow themselves up. They got immunity to that. I think at one point in time they didn't, so that they could blow each other up. But, um, oh yeah, here's another thing. If you can cause an explosion next to a door, you can leave a room before all the enemies are destroyed. That's a nice little tactic that you can use right there. Take that to the bank. Okay. But, uh, they can destroy, uh, the environment. But, um... I should... Oh, come on, that missed them. Cool. Okay. Since I'm killing them, I should be dealing more damage. There we are. Ooh, more keys. Thank you. Okay. These assholes. Oh, God. See how I said this was like a bullet hell? Oh, jeez, look at my head. This is a glitch. Um, I, I think it had to... Okay, I'm just a floating head. Now, this is the thing that you could use, um, but this is obviously a glitch. Okay, we got Guardian Angel. Do you remember Cube of Meat? Well, it's like that, except it's much closer to us, and uh, it moves faster. All right. Oh, look at that. It also made our Cube of Meat move faster. So now we have a little orbit thing so that we can uh, hurt enemies with, or we can um, uh, block damage. How come I can't fly through things anymore? Oh, I got massive uh, frame drops. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, good. I was able to... Oh, thank you. All right, now we can finally go into that fucking secret room. Jesus Christ. <gasps> the golden key. Okay, or is that dad's key? Anyways, um, I think what the dad key does is that it unlocks every single door in the game. Let's see. Dad's key. Space to use. Oh. Mm, do I want dad's key? No, I'm doing good on keys. But, um, you use the, uh, dad's key, and I think it gives you a free key. Okay, this thing allows you to go down to the next level, but I don't like to do that. Because, like, going through the levels allows you to get better power-ups. If we, um, just spam that thing so that, uh, yeah, let's not do that. Alright. Hopefully that the, uh, oh my god, super gluttony. That fat tub of shit. Shooting blood out of its JJ. Holy hell. Yeah, this thing is scary. I mean, like, there's regular gluttony, and then there's this. Apparently, gluttony is a girl. I wouldn't think that thing is a girl, but look, it's got a vagina. Oh, I can go over holes. What am I doing? It can't go over holes! But I can. Mm -mm. Come on. One more hit. Just die. God damn it. Ah, uh, troll bomb. Fine, whatever. Um, I don't have enough. I believe if we beat the boss, I'll have enough recharge so that we can come back here and uh, use the uh, space bar item, the, uh, the dice. I'm very picky when it comes to uh, what I replace the dice item with. Damn it. I need to get uh, faster shots. That would uh, be that would be very beneficial so that um, my charge shots doesn't take as long. And unfortunately, in this form, it doesn't give me much of a tell of what... Uh, yeah, it doesn't give me a tell of how much charge he is. Okay, let's see who we got. Ooh, we got the husk. Okay. The husk is uh, sort of like another item, except it's a tougher version. Fortunately for you and me, we got these uh, rocks. Now, the important thing here is, is to not focus on the little enemies that it shoots out. Even though we got lust, we need to take out the source of it or we're never going to beat it. Oh, and thanks to uh, my combinations, it was very easy. <gasps> okay, I think this is... Um, uh, well, anyways, it gives us damage up, I think. Oh, no, stem cells. It gives us health up. 
but I think it has a secondary ability. And we got um, full uh, dice, so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to call that an episode here, and the next episode we are going to go back to the secret room and use our uh, dice on that item. So, see you... Oh, yeah, and then we're going to go down to the next level. See you then. Bye!